Good morning, hot dogs. Welcome back to the morning announcements. Crash, bowling callouts, sports, and more after the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. If you're interested in applying for CRASH, sign up while you can. The deadline is September 14th. What is CRASH, you may ask? CRASH Club was founded in 2012 to raise awareness around issues that, that affect the Latino community support students pursuing higher education. Bridge the gap of communication and understanding between the English-speaking and Spanish-speaking communities. Provide community service and collaborate with community with community partners to enrich the experiences of youth in our school. And youth in our school cooperation. If you have any questions, feel free to email Ms. Johnson. Call outs for bowling will be today at 6.45 p.m. in the Big Shelter House at the TPA Park. For lunch, today lines one and two will be chicken smackers and lines three and four taco snack. For tomorrow, lines one and two will be pizza sticks and lines three and four corn dogs. Not to sports and weather. Thank you, Alan. As we come to the end of the summer, the temperature starts to drop. This morning, it was pretty cold with it being 55 degrees, and later today, the high will be 70 degrees, not even reaching the 80s. And later tonight, it will drop down to 56 degrees. There will be a slight breeze today. It's starting to feel like fall. Not to sports with Elijah. Thanks, David. The volleyball teams continue to struggle with injuries and quarantine girls. Both teams fell to Western 0-2, and one to three. Late game services run from Morgan Adamson kept the varsity alive, but it wasn't enough to force a game five. The cross country team still hasn't received official results from Tuesday's meet hosted by the Mounties of Southmont. That six teams competing. However, we do know that boys nearly got second to Sagamore Conference defending champs Lebanon by five points or so. While placing five guys in top 11 of the race, Josue Bautista won the meet, followed by Angel Perez in second. Other top 10 finishers were Marco Reyes in ninth and Daniel Pritchard in tenth. Girls' top 10 finishers include Karina Alanis in second, and I'm in fifth, and Alexis Regill in tenth. The girls' golf team hosted Lebanon last night. Emily Shipley finished with a 49. Chris Lynn followed with a 68. Good job, ladies. Tomorrow night, the football team will be playing the Bruins of Tri-West. Go out and support. But if you can't make it, don't worry, because the Hot Dog Network will partner with the ISC Sports Network for free on the YouTube channel. So go check it out. The theme is Mardi Gras, so go out and buy your gear in the comments. Now let's transfer to the host. Reminder that don't forget to show up for tomorrow for a Mardi Gras night to support our hot dogs playing against Tri-West. That's it for today's announcements. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like and subscribe for more.